No, do not step in the dog shit. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Oh! How's it going, everyone? My name is Nori Plays, and welcome to a brand new series. This is Little Misfortune, a game I missed out on back in the day. As you can see, it was made in 2019. So, this is gonna be a blast. I remember Jacksepticeye playing a different game from the same people called uh, Franbo. So, I might also check that out after. I don't know, we'll see. But, let's get right into it. Little Misfortune, I know nothing about this game. Let's dig right in. Straight away, like a desolate space. The dude's just chilling, dragging the coffin along. more about it. What's going on? Is this the character we're playing as? Very interesting. Whoa. I think we're in the game now. Everything's gone real smooth. Welcome to my game. I feel welcomed. I'll be your host and humble narrator. The rules of this game are simple. I like Play simple. Until the end, and you'll be rewarded. <laughs> All right. Sounds easy enough, if you ask me. This is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you, and a little bit for me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the sad part is today is the day she will die. Oh, huh. I can hear you, you know. Oh? You can? <laughs> mm-hmm. Are you inside my head or something? Hmm. Well, okay. Yes. <laughs> All right. I'll call you Mr. Voice. O what did you say about me dying today? Die? No. Nobody said anything about anyone dying today. <laughs> Nobody said no. nothing? Nobody you said anything. I have prepared a game for you. A game? Really? For me? If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. Deal? Eternal happiness? I guess I could give that to my mommy. Okay, it's a deal. Oh. Okay. Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to play? Yes. Your first mission is to leave the house. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Oh, here we go. Oh. Interact with your spacebar. Okay, radio. I like to move my body. <laughs> mm hmm. It's the music that goes on forever. Yo, she's breaking it down. Okay, let's go. Oh, okay, that's that say less. Look, this is my secret hiding spot. Oh, impressive. But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. 
And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. <laughs> hmm. This is Babsy, the guardian of the secret spot. You see his eye? He got that from a battle against a monster. A monster? That sounds scary. Not an actual monster, though. Yes. Surely. This is my diary. Nobody is allowed to read it. Want to see? Uh, Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez. I'm so cute. <laughs> did you draw all this? Uh huh. She did not draw that. Come on. No shot. No shot did she draw that. <laughs> Benjamin. Ugh, that fox. Yes. Uh, Hello diary, at school I drew and at home I was at, at my hiding spot talking to Bubsy and I heard it. I saw a fox walking outside my room. He's called Benjamin, I think. Oh, yikes forever. Uh, my dad lied to me again, not going out to the park today. I made myself free, but he doesn't care. I feel sad, I cried, but told mommy I'm okay. I'm afraid if I tell her I'm sad, she'll be angry. Sometimes I don't know how to feel. Nobody's teaching me how to feel. I wish in school they teach us where feelings come from, but for reals. No fairy tales. Well, that's very sad and depressing. Hello, diary. Is it okay to have feelings for a fox? <laughs> the puke of love. That's what it is. Oh. Yeah, right. I completely ignore, ignore that the heart is just salivating all over the floor with vomit. Benjamin the fox came to visit when I was playing outside and we looked at each other and my heart felt warm and like I was about to vomit but in a good way. Then he ran away because my mommy shouted that dinner was ready. Ah, uh, daddy hit mommy. I don't like it when daddy hits mommy. Should I hit people I love? It doesn't feel right. Maybe daddy can't see he's hurting me too when he hits mommy. Uh, I know about Japan because my friend is Japanese. He likes sushi. My Japanese friend speaks Japanese. It's very problematic when we want to talk. It's hard to understand each other. It's confusing, but I like him. He has a pair of sweet boots and a cowboy hat. His name is Hiro and he's a ghost. That's Hiro, my Japanese friend. He's oh. a ghost. <laughs> it's not Japanese. Uh... Wow, there's so many pages. Picking tomatoes with the grandma. Swimming. And chilling. Look at that picture. I was such a baby. Very cute. She sounds Russian, kind of. I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Right, how does one back out of this one? X. Okay. Weird control scheme, but I shall take it. Yeah, what else are we saying? What's this? Look, I made these paper dolls myself. This is Kimberly and this is Steven. They're on a trip fighting super evils. She's a very funny and wholesome character so far. I like it. Okay. I guess I have glitter. And I can throw glitter. Something tells me that's gonna come in handy. Here once. I showed it the finger and it never came back. Wait, was the door always open? Before you leave, which toy do you choose to bring? Oh god. With? Can't I take them both? No. You can only choose one. And remember, your choice is much more important than you think. Okay, I choose... Unicorn or stone? Unicorn. I choose my soft and beautiful unicorn. Perfect. You can never go wrong. I wonder what would have happened if I picked the stone. Oh! Oh! I didn't realize the face was like that. And so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Happiness to everything! Oh no. 
on the other side of the screen. What's up? Remember I told you she was going to die today? Yeah. Let's keep that a secret between us, all right? Uh, no promises, man. No promises. I kind of want to tell the kid about it, but... Oh. This is Grandma. She wears a diaper, too. <laughs> you still wear a diaper? Nah. That was so last year. <laughs> <laughs> Last year is crazy. Mommy likes to collect glasses. I broke a couple ones by running too fast. Did mommy find out who did it? No, but I had a piece of glass in my face oh! for like five days. It's like stepping on a shift. Oh, my God. oh please don't fall off. Damn it, it's all broken now. That was a Beautiful example of cause and effect. Please don't tell on me. Don't worry. You can trust me. You can't okay. trust the narrator. Already. He told us not to tell her, which means he's a bad person. Hmm. Maybe I could try to fix it. With, with what, glue? Uh, I mean a kid fixing it? Let's try it. What could possibly go wrong? It. I'm doing it. Oh. Oh, I I can fix it. So that goes there. I think this piece goes here. I can't possibly be wrong with that idea. Then then I think this piece right here goes on the bottom. Yeah. And then this piece goes here. Look at that. I'm such a genius, dude. The problem with this is going to be figuring out the pieces in between. But you know what? We're a genius anyway, so we make it work. Look at that. Like it was never broken. Perfect! They're not gonna notice. Mommy said she married daddy because she was expecting me. She wanted to have an abortion. Oh! But it's illegal and against <laughs> the law. That's kind of the same thing. I'm sorry for laughing. Yes. It's just not what I was expecting out of this. Look, that's me. Mommy told me I have to smile even when I'm sad. Well, that's just selfish. You, you should be allowed to be sad. Whenever you want to be sad. Ugh, it smells like cigarettes. In oh, I wonder yeah, why. That's my mommy. She also likes to drink juice a lot. <laughs> well, are you ready to complete your first mission? Yes, I am. I'm gonna get that prize. What prize? Oh, dead rabbits again? When will daddy learn I like them alive? What the f Mommy, this smells really bad. What is it? Dead and what? That's what it is. What? It's forever. No, you are not throwing glitter in there. Yay! Happiness to the soup! <laughs> what is that? What did I just do? Hello, mom. I'm not even gonna say anything to you. I think I'm just gonna leave. That's today. Something tells me if I talk to you, you're gonna kill me. When I grow up, I want to be just like my mommy. A juice drinker. Okay, she won't even say a word to you. Understandable. Let's not tell her we're leaving. Quiet, okay? Good day, morning. It's afternoon, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. Good afternoon, morning. <laughs> <laughs> Such a silly you. Okay. So, where are we? This is where I saw a really cute fox. I call him Benjamin. I've seen him around the house. 
right outside my window. I think he's really cute. Please, Miss Fortune, you should be careful around wild True. animals. You shouldn't trust a fox. They're all criminals. Nah, come on. What? A fox criminal? <laughs> That's silly. She's not wrong. That is pretty stupid what you just said. This pool smells like a toilet. <laughs> because I pee on it. <laughs> that is disgusting. Not as disgusting as when my daddy peed. Oh! That was disgusting. <laughs> really? I didn't need to know that. It went from one bad thing to another. <laughs> Hello, kitty. Here, come. Come, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Kitty! Come, come. Kitty, don't go! That guy is so stupid looking. Damn it. I never get to pet the sweet animals. Probably because so, that cat isn't really you sweet. You need to know the rules of the game, Miss Fortune. All right. Remember, you will be given choices on your journey. Okay, choices? There is no right or wrong, only consequences. Okay, okay, only consequences. When you beat the game, the prize of eternal happiness is yours. I'm ready. Your next mission is to cross this road. All right, I can do that. Look to the left, look to the right. Any cars? No. Okay, I'm going. No, I bet you. The moment I'm right in the middle of that road, something's gonna happen. I'm calling it right now! That something's gonna happen. What did I say? What? Is that a Satan? I saw a monster. What monster? I didn't see anything. I the saw bird. It's probably just your imagination. Yeah, that's true. I have a very big one. Just keep going. We'll have so much fun. Fun. Oh, <laughs> it's not like the monster from the other dimension is just gonna grab me by the neck and twist it. Look, a sleepy bird. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go now. Oh, she's so innocent to the point where it's a bit painful. She looks different in this girl scene. No, 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 no way. Did she just put glitter on dead birds? Or sparkles? What? What is going on in this game? This is going to be a trip. <laughs> is eternal happiness death by any chance for this for this girl? Huh, I used a little sparkle back there. Anyway, where are we? You tell me, miss. Look, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware of the consequences. All right. Oh, okay. But if I play with it, that means it's still going to be tied to the tree, right? So that the owner or whoever left that dog there can, uh, you know. Hmm. But if I set it free, it will go wherever, probably run away. So I'm just going to play with it. I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now, throw the ball at it. What ball? This ball. 
that bowl. Okay. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> that is pretty unfortunate. Bubba. Oh. What did oh. I do? It's all broken now. Mr. Voice, everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong with Wait, so even if I let it free, it would have died. It's just unfair. But I'm here for you. Knowing her. Her misfortune. Well, sadly. The puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George. Ah! Ah! Go and tell him about No, the no, no. Accident. No. Uh, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. No, no, no. I'm sorry I broke you, puppy. I really am. Maybe we can play later. You know, when I'm broken too. Huh. Sprinkles! Yeah! It solves. What does that mean? I'll take the party hat as a symbol of our friendship, puppy doggy. What does that say? Is that Swedish? Is that in Swedish for dogs something not about loud or something? It says no dogs allowed. Uh. Oh, really? So that is the owner's fault, ultimately. No, do not step in the dog shit. Come on. <laughs> Come on! Oh! Oh no, I step on doggy doo. Oh. Oh. Yeah. oh! Yeah, but then you're gonna step in that as well. Oh, sweet. I can see my footprint. Let's see what came out. No, I don't want to see what came out. And Glitter? That rice pudding? <laughs> I can't watch this anymore. Please, let's keep moving. This game is bizarre. This game is so bizarre. What? For this bastard. I did ah! Come on. Wake up, body. We need to do some... Bad strokes of luck. That sign doesn't work. Do you see all the crap lying around? Oh, do not litter. That's a good observation, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. So, so Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes, that too. What is at the end of this? You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. <laughs> oh my... That's terrible. God. Yeah, I almost died. How can you say that so casually? <laughs> Whoa, those are big birds. What the hell? Oh, what's happening? I think you're in big trouble. She doesn't look very scared. Yeah, <laughs> this bird's taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it, fast. What do you want me to do about it? Kick them in the balls or throw glare at the birds? Throw glare at them. Okay, my glitter is shiny. So if I throw glitter at the birds, Surely. they will see shiny. And they will get confused and leave me alone. That sounds like a solid plan, Miss Fortune. All right, here I go. Counter attack! I knew it. Did I want to get dropped, though? <laughs> Wait, can I can I move her? I can. Ugh, this is taking a long time. <laughs> we didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are. In what day. is happening? I think you are. Hello. Hey, look, a birdie. Hello, birdie. Why is it swearing at you? That was a rude bird. <laughs> what? How? Oh, why didn't I break my legs and die? Mm, 
You seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> Are you sure you have misfortune? Yeah, Mr. Boys, is the party on the same line to the eternal happiness? Yes, yes it is. Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? How does a kid like her know the word yes. convenient? I mean, if you want to. Will you tell George about the accident? I don't know what George is like. No. No, I don't want to get in trouble. And I really want to dance at the party. All right, then. Yeah, somebody tells me if I told him we're oh, dead. A boat. I hope I'm right. Hello. So far... Just a little bit I can harder. see that moral decisions are always going to end up badly. Uh, ah, a fish! What should we do about it? Well, if you bring it with you, it's just going to die on the way there. Release it? But at the same time, there's a lot of trash there. Let's bring it with us, you know what? Let's be a little bit goofy today with our decisions. Rodrigo and he needs a new place to stay. He looks so unbothered. I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know. <laughs> this game is funny. I am enjoying this. You guys were right. I was right to believe in you guys for a recommendation. And here we are, the house of George. I'm a bit nervous about introducing myself. You'll do fine. Just don't mention the puppy like we discussed earlier. Yes, okay. I'll just dance. Dance to like no music or, or something? Oh, he actually looks like an okay guy. There's a dead fish in the tank. Uh, I'm pretty sure you knock first. Nobody's answering. I'll invite myself. No, 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 no. This is not to check out the party. what I want you to do, bro. You ring the bell. I saw a man once floating in the lake. Just like this fisher. Okay. Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like this with my mommy and daddy. That's so sad. Oh. Hello? What is it, Miss Fortune? His son is Nothing. dead. He's ethereal. It's an ethereal being. Are you sure this is the right house? Where is the party? Hello? This is the wrong house. Oh my. Excuse me. Are you George? He's not going to answer you. I don't know anything about any puppy, but I was promised a party. Oh no, wait. It looks like he hung himself. Hung himself? Like a piñata? Should I hit him? No! Like a no, <laughs> no! He's dead. Dead? But he's wearing a pair of sweet boots. <laughs> he, he can't be dead. It, nice logic. This is very dark humor so far. Okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, I think this party's over. Let's leave. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Sprinkle that bitch. Shut up. Happiness to George the Piñata. <laughs> what does that heart mean? I sure okay, hope that's a good thing. Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. Yes. Okay. Let's keep going, I guess. I want to be happy. What's with the music? A very ominous music. Oh, I love the woods. I hate the woods. The and the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, Miss Fortune. You might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Yes, but all foxes are evil, so keep your eyes open. Uh, all right. Why are foxes evil? 
Tell me why. What's your reason behind them being evil? Well, to be fair, story time, by the way. I'm going to take a little bit of time, of your time, to tell you a little bit of a story. I, my neighbor had a rabbit, okay? My neighbor had a rabbit. One night, I hear screaming. I was like, wait, is that, is that like a baby child or something? No, it was my neighbor's rabbit getting his head torn off by a fox in the middle of the night. The, t the fox somehow got into the cage with the rabbit. And uh, yeah, next morning, next thing you know, the head was gone. Hope you liked that story. If you did comment, um, headless rabbit. Lol. Um, everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. Everything begins oh. with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> All right. Oh, do not take a voodoo doll. I'll keep it. Hey, what do you have there? Nothing. She says nothing. It's definitely a cursed object. Oh. Stay back, Miss Fortune. <gasps> what is it? Is oh, that blood? A dangerous fox. Wait, I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. No. Nah. I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do you want to play with me? Oh no, don't go! Oh. <sighs> what a relief. We are safe now. Let's keep playing my game. Okay. There's a magical cave nearby. You need to find it. A magical cave? Okay. <laughs> I like how she's just agreeing to whatever the voice is in her head. <gasps> it looks like Benjamin likes to paint. No, he was definitely uh, painting a portal here. Focus, Miss Fortune. We need to keep going. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're being awfully... Um... What's the word? I'm trying to find a word. <laughs> Awfully calm about this situation. Oh, police. Alright, this is where you stop and you turn back and you go home. But no. Oh, is this the magical cave? It magical cave, magical. cave of Just dead people. Wait until you go inside. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> I have a question. What does this sign mean? Uh, oh, I don't know. Avalanche, rocks cool. falling. Ah, cool. So, whenever you're ready. Stay in the forest. you stay in the forest. But then you won't find the eternal happiness. You bastard. The narrator... The narrator is gonna kill her, bro. Ah, uh, the game wants me to go in. No! Uh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. No. <gasps> this game is huge! How long has she been gone for by now? Well, let's explore the cave. I'm wondering. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm just joking. There was no echo. It was me. You're a real comedian, Miss Fortune. Thank you. The cave is gonna get barred in. No, bro, no, no, no. Oh! <gasps> what was that? What? Did I miss something? I'm not sure. Ah. All right. Well, that I didn't see a hamster on the race car. Is there a party in here? What's this? The hamster party? Oh my oh, god! Party. Nude hamsters. Do I? <laughs> Can we go inside? I don't know. Let's go find out. Uh, am I allowed to? What's <laughs> 
<laughs> I didn't notice the hamster of the Ooh, boobies. Hamster fight! Are you going to do something about it? Yes. I am the police officer. Don't fight, you adorable things. You have to kiss and make up. <laughs> there you go. Oh, please, sweetie, don't go. You dropped something. Oh my god, he dropped drugs. Oh, are those mints? No, they are not mints. No, no, no. I'm a little lady, you know. Oh! Wow, I'm feeling really nice. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh! Are you joking? Yeah. They were not mints. Let me tell you that. They were not mints for sure. And they were not tasty, probably. How long were you at? Oh, okay. Well, that wasn't a minty refreshment. How many of them did you eat? Are you all right, Miss Fortune? I'm okay. I'm glad that you're okay. Excuse me, who a little lady getting inside? No, I'm not very important, you said? Okay. Can you believe this guy, Mr. Voice? We have to find another way out now. Yeah, I'd be concerned if you went in there anyway. So, I mean, look, look at what's going on here. These tiny cutie cars are killing me with their cuteness. <laughs> so cute. Look at them, with their tiny cocktails and their tiny clothing. This is too cute for me. Hmm. It's cute for you, but an average adult would say the opposite. Uh, is that contraband? Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh no, I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes, looks like she was robbed. Oh. I bet it was that hamster with the black mask. Yes, you're right. Oh, he stole Looks her like purse. The criminal is <laughs> no. Oh, damn it. Does that mean I'm a criminal too? Of course it does. Oh, really? Please don't tell me. Your secret is safe with me. Thank you. But, but what if I did the other thing? He would have killed the guy. Excuse me. Do you need assistance? No? Okay. If she just got up. We need to find a way out now. The eternal happiness is still out there. Okay, I'll look around. Okay. So there's a barn. There's some crates. There's a stool. I wonder what this button does. Let's press the button. Another fancy. Good job, Miss Fortune. You found the way out. The accent is strong in this one. Is it like a Swedish accent? I'm trying to think. Like Scandinavian, something like that. Fanta. <laughs> Climb the ladder or stay in the sewer. I want to get out of here. I do not want to stay in here. We could have stayed and went back to the club, actually. Can I go back? Nope. I cannot go back. What does that say? Stop! I hope I said that right. I was trying to sound as Swedish as possible. Whoa, they're huge! This looks just like a movie. Breaking I Bad! The, the Godfather! I think you're right. We need to clear the way before we can proceed. But this is so funny. Fire alarm over there. There's we probably references I'm gonna miss yeah, because I'm uncultured no. like that, but With a slingshot. What slingshot? This slingshot. 
Ah, that slingshot. Okay. I appreciate the slingshot, dude. I use these acorns as ammunition. That's really clever, Miss Fortune. <laughs> I know, thank you. Aim with up, down, or WS. What am I supposed to shoot? That was really close. Oh! I'm insane at this game. Second try. They call me the sniper. We did it! Well done, Miss Fortune. Yay! <laughs> right, what are they dealing here? They're dealing in acorns? Again, as a Godfather reference on that poster. Squirrel speed. Fancy. I agree. It's very fancy. This looks like the science project Daddy has in the bed. Oh my I don't know god. Mommy was really angry about it. Yo, she was born into the wrong family. That's a lot of cash. Is this the eternal happiness? Oh no. What makes you think that? Mommy said that money is the only thing that makes her happy. Gold well, digger. Your mommy is wrong. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, man. It's tackling some heavy concepts as well. But in a really innocent way. Like money and happiness, you know? Money, happiness, dad making drugs and shit in the, in the basement. I could stay, but why? There's nothing else here. No, no, no point. Missing. There's a person missing. Hey, you. On the other side of the screen. What's good? Listen, I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. Will misfortune really die? If so, how will she die? And when will the evil fox kill her? Will she find the eternal happiness? I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act normal. She's coming. Acting. <laughs> oh, Miss Fortune, you made it. Congratulations. Thank you. Where are we? We're one step closer to the grand prize of eternal happiness. Great, because I'm not allowed to be outside this lake, you know. Don't worry, it's not far from here. Great. <laughs> Pretty sure now, even if she did want to turn back, she can't. Look, a missing kid. Okay, remember her face. Wide Sid eyes. Very small nose, very small mouth. The mouth is also very high up on the face. And she seems to have locks. We, we're also supposed to call 112. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Besides, I didn't tell mommy I went outside. Bye. Don't go now, Miss Fortune. I can protect you. Really? Yes. Oh, really? <laughs> wow. Top 10 gullible moments. Oh my goodness. Oh, she's dead. Call 112 right now! Hello. She got ran over. Ugh, smells like poop. Um. Miss Fortune, watch your language. <laughs> okay. I just got really lucky. A unicycle. Get it? <laughs> Very clever, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. Why are people wearing masks? Why is this so creepy? Phantasmagoria. There's a phone number there. A horror fair. <gasps> Phantasmagoria is coming to Oberfield? That's so awesome. Maybe we could find time to check it out later. Who knows? Right. Don't play with my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal happiness first. Then we'll see. Alright, I can't wait. 
they'll probably not even let you in to begin with. Also, that says lol right there. I keep thinking that these guys are child snatchers. It's Benjamin from the Hoots in the Woods. <laughs> Hoots you know, in the Woods. If you ever want to hang out or something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. I, I like how that guy walked past it like dangerous. nothing's happening. Let me handle this. Benji, are you a wild, dangerous fox? <gasps> no, Benji, don't go! Let that wild beast run off. I don't you? want anything bad happening to you. All right. Hide your children. Hide your child. Ah, oh, this is Benji's. Oh. Stuff. This is absolutely the best it's the creature. I've ever seen. It's so personal. I didn't know Benjamin was so creative. Creative? That looks like a child has drawn it. What did you just say? Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Huh. Hey, shouldn't we be focusing on finding the prize? I'm focused. Hey, lady. You wanna talk? No? Okay. My bad. Do we get a train? Or something? Are we going to the park? Yes. Okay. You're awfully compliant, is what I wanted to say like 10 minutes ago or something. Language. I finally found the word. Mr. Voice? Yes, Miss Fortune? Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yes, of course. They lived happily ever after. That sounds nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some happiness. My sparkle doesn't work with her. Oh, that's really sweet of you. Thank you. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. There's birds just dying all around her every time. Happiness to Mr. Boys! Oh, well. Thank you. Anyway, let's go find the prize and make Mummy proud. Yes. 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 We must make Mummy proud. Um... It says, don't feed the birds. Ah, okay. Noted. Is that? There's a lot of sweet poetry. Oh. Death is alive and it's eating from you. Sign <laughs> and mm, interesting. What do you think? Yo. <coughs> Miss Fortune, Yo. you really need to read those poems. Oh my God, read them. Yeah, listen to this one. Both hanging too low. Oh. Where are they hanging from? Oh, no. a drawing of a cat. Oh. Oh, misfortune. Oh. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm reading them. There's Fran Bo. It says Fran Bo on the bench. There's also a, a stick man with a willy. And the person taking it up the bum is, is like imagining a condom. What? What is this bench? This bench has gone through war. Eat fruits and veggies. That's the one only wholesome thing on there, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's perfectly normal. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Fascinating. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo? My fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. It's gonna hmm. eat it. I guess that maybe that will be a fair thing. You know what? Maybe do, Stop guess. using your common sense. Common sense is bad in this game. Give him the fish. Oh, don't throw it at him. This fish brings you as much joy and love as it did to me. It's dead anyway. Very kind of you. Thank you. What? Oh no! Rodrigo is dead now. 
Of course. Seagulls love eating fish. Why didn't you say something? Well, now you know. Isn't it fun to learn? I... The more you know. The more you know. I was right. I should have listened to my common sense all along. Would you like to ride the royal halls of the park? Yeah, hell yeah. She, she's very unlucky though. Hold on royal a minute. Royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. Look at me. I'm on the horse. Hi, horsey. Stop it. Oh. I knew it. Ah, oh, that was unfortunate. Are you alright? I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny and you could break. I broke my arm once. So, you know what I mean. <laughs> and the narrator's trying to kill you. Oi! Misfortune. He's trying to kill you. Go back home. To your di very dilapidated family. Check out that duck. Let's just go, Misfortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> don't be silly. Ducks are pretty cool. And look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? Oh, hell yeah. Go, show me your jam. Of course, check this out. Oh, the smoke. <coughs> it's okay, it's okay. That was unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Inhaling those fumes from the Zaza. Great. <laughs> oh my god. Would you like to ride this one? It's like a tornado. Yes. Ride it. <laughs> yes, I want to ride. My god, stop! <laughs> ah, I can't hold it! And uh, whoopee! Oh no, misfortune! <laughs> she just laughs it off! When the trees are naked, when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against a stone. That's number two. When the trees are naked, <laughs> when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against a stone. When the trees are ah, naked, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against the stone. All right. Mm, apple pie. What are you? That is not what that meant. Nothing. <sighs> what does that say? Hey. This looks like the art of Benjamin. Don't you it think? does. I think it's garbage. And it should be erased with the fire. The narrator is evil. Really? I see great potential here. He's obviously very artistic. Just ignore it. Let's keep playing my game. The prize is closer than you think. <laughs> really? All right. Do you reckon the fox is also writ? Oh, is it writ or wrote? I'm just going to say wrote. Do you reckon the author was, well, author? The fox is also written, wrote, the hide your children as well. Please, uh, I, 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 I didn't have enough happiness. sleep today. Good. The last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. A pet cemetery? That sounds like the best place to end the game. Exactly my thoughts. I'm glad you feel the same way. <laughs> but I'm going to leave you guys on a cliffhanger before we go to that pet cemetery. Something tells me something's going to go very badly there. So if you guys enjoyed the first episode of Misfortune, I have um, definitely enjoyed playing this so far for the first hour. But if you are new, subscribe smash the like button for me if you enjoyed the video and comment down below with your thoughts but besides that i will see all of you amazing people in the next episode see you later